Hello everyone and welcome once again to the same workshop. Today I would like to show you how to take an Agbada measurement. Uh, here I have an Agbada and I, I'm not yet done with this, with the finishing of the net actually. But before I go into those details, I would like to explain Agbada to you. There are three different kinds of Agbada if you don't know. There is a Magzi, there is a Mini and there is a Macro. We call it um, Maxi Agbada, Minimum, Mini Agbada, and Macro Agbada. Mostly Maxi Agbada are those ones you mostly see probably on all those senators with Victor. <laughs> Does that really make sense? Those are mostly like Maxi Agbada because it is very long and it's just the sleeve that makes the difference actually. It is mostly long probably around this, um, around the tip of the finger or around the palm. Those are Maxi Agbada. And the, um, the mini agbada is mostly in between your palm and your um, your elbow. It's mostly around three quarter of here. And the mini agbada is mostly around your elbow side. That's just the difference between the three type of agbada. And some you can go for an embroidery and ju just an embroidery like this one or anything you decide. But make sure before you decide to go for an agbada, make sure you have a design on you. You can use Photoshop or you can use Illustrator to Adobe Illustrator to make a design for your outfit if you are into that kind of thing. And also, if you like to watch the full stitching of this video, I will upload it soon, probably here or on my on my website. And also, if you have not done, try and check out my website. You can go to www.sewworkshop.com.ng. There are so many free videos there, they are not that are not on my YouTube channel, and there are so many detailed videos there that are part of my intensive class. So the very first thing I'll be doing here is I'll be taking the measurements. So to take an agbada measurement, there are just two measurements you need, which is the length from here to here. Also, lest I forget, this is a mini agbada, it's just a casual kind of agbada like that. It is around um, 25 year of the ham, around three quarter. So it's a mini agbada, it's not a maxi agbada. I upload a video about um, the cutting and the sewing of the maxi agbada. If you wanna know how I cut this also, I will upload a video here or on my in my intensive class, if you want to see that. So to take this measurement, all you just have to do in the front of your client, just make sure your client is standing very, very straight like this and take your measurement to wherever he prefer, he or she prefer. If you can also use it, yeah. Wherever he or she prefer, this is actually at 50 inch. This is the normal length I also use for my Abada, it's mostly 50 inch. And some might not want it to be as long as that, but the, ma the maximum length you can have on Abada, the minimum length, sorry, the minimum length you can have on Abada is mostly 40. 5 inch, that is it. If it's anything shorter than that, then you are wearing a dashiki. You know what I'm saying? Dashiki. Yeah. So, when you take the full measurement from this shoulder, from your shoulder right here, down to the, to the length you wish you want, then you return the outfit. You turn, um, you ask your client to probably turn, turn their back. Yeah, let's turn your back like that. Then you take your measurement of your sleeve from here, sorry, from in between the bone at the back of your client. Is it, is it like the back bone? <laughs> Shit, this is crazy. Like the back bone of your client, you just take a measurement and just ask your client to like stretch for their hand. Can you see that? And just choose your preferred length. Or your client's preferred length. Just take it. This is at 25 inch, as I said before. It's at 25 inch. But if your client wants it to be um, probably the maxi one, which is mostly at the tip of the finger, you will just take the measurement from this particular side of your client to the tip of their finger. That is what you use to work. So if you want to see how the cutting of this outfit, it will be on my intensive class. Yeah, so that is it for now to measure an Agbada outfit. And I hope you guys like the video, and I will see you soon.
Enjoy yourself. And